So yesterday, popular leaker Temporal released a screenshot of five currency packages in the files and also obviously some soldier weapon and vehicle cosmetics and XP boosts. Now, the reason I'm making this video, first and foremost, again, take all this with a grain of salt. This is data mined information from update 4.0. So there's no actual release date for this, but I'm mostly making this as a PSA in hopes that DICE and EA maybe get wind of this message. Do not release microtransactions before season one. That will make a whole lot of people angry. Obviously, with update 4.0, uh, it, it made it painfully obvious that the game was not ready for release like no matter how much EA and DICE want to spin the message that oh we thought the game was you know okay for release and we had some pretty good stability and all that no no you didn't you knew the game was not ready for release and the reason why we have so many features that were called legacy features is because the devs simply didn't have time to work on them because the game was rushed to market now I think this is probably one of the worst live service examples we've gotten for any dice games i think it's even worse than battlefield 5. Uh, i think at this point we had already gotten some content for battlefield 5 and now they're at this point for battlefield 2042 they're still working on fixing uh bugs and glitches and balancing the the game in itself and we're not getting any content until early summer allegedly they said early summer so season one early summer again that could be delayed if shit hit the fan or they have to work on other things but i can't stress this enough the game is still not in a great state you burned so many people while releasing it early in the state it was in uh and now we're just starting to get back on track but having a live service game and having promise of content coming because the content for battlefield 2042 is abysmal everybody's waiting for more content to come to battlefield 2042 but if you release microtransactions and the premium currency prior to actually showing people the content that's on offer, man, that would be a huge kick in the teeth for everybody that supported Battlefield 2042 and that are still playing it. And I think it would be a huge PR misstep to do so. People already paid an overwhelmingly absurd price for what Battlefield 2042 has to offer and how it launched and asking them for more money before getting anything else in the game to quench the thirst for content because the game has no content or very little and the content that is on offer is pretty poor most notably the maps asking people for more money before releasing new content and fixing existing content would be awful i can tell you right now people will not be happy if boins so the premium battlefield currency is released prior to season one i can't see that going well for ea and dice in terms of pr and just people already don't think a lot of ea and dice at this point i mean i have lost a lot of faith in them uh, a lot of respect as well for the company and for me personally it's going to take a lot of work and determination for them to regain that trust and respect and how they can do that is fix Battlefield 2042, release good content for it, and the next game you release, maybe don't drop the ball. Maybe push something to market when it's actually ready for release instead of making paying customers suffer through a terrible launch, countless bugs, game instability, server issues, balance problems, lack of content, just to name a few, and then you might gain some of my respect and faith in you back, but... Ooh, having the microtransactions released before season one if that's the case if that's their game plan right now scrap it don't release any microtransactions don't ask people for more money people have already been burned with the money they already spent on the game i realize the main purpose of releasing products like this is to make money but the fact of the matter is you release something way too early to market and if you are losing money and you have to bite the bullet of the costs of repairing your mistakes before asking people for more money. But anyways, that'll do it for today's video. Let me know what you think about this. Again, take all this with a grain of salt. This was found in the update 4.0 files. There's no official release date for the premium currency or the microtransactions that will be featured in the store. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to make 
a video talking about if they release that before season one, it, it will not go well for them. It, I can't see any version of this in which they can spin this as a positive thing and there's going to be a whole lot of backlash uh, in the case that they would release this before they offer new content and, of course, revisit and rebalance existing content in Battlefield 2042. But anyways, hit the like button if you enjoyed the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and as always, thank you very much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.